Drivers behind the lines. Three, two, one, crescendo! Welcome to a match number three, 987, running forward with their multi-node auto, and it just flips into the speaker. 192 GRT is parked and ready to go here in just a second. Blue Alliance taking a rest here as Autonomous ends. Blue Alliance has the five-point advantage going into teleoperated period. 987 cleaning up those last few notes there on the field. Looks like we have 841 taking a little bit of a rest there. They're blocking access to the amp. 192 GRT pushing them out of the way. Also helping our wonderful CSAs get a better idea of what is going on. Over on the blue side, the Jankster's Machine picking up a note from off the field. Scoring it up high, no problem for them. Space Cookies as well, running interference there in the middle of the field, but picking up another note that's available on blue. Over on the red side of the field, the high rollers picking up a note and placing it into the amp. 1967 lining up carefully there, amplified there on the Blue Lions side, helping them to pull ahead 13 points. Red still looking for a few more points to catch up. They are getting ready to amplify. Looks like 987 seeing some interference there from the Space Cookies machine. 1351 TKO dropping off another note in the amp. 192 GRT getting ready to continue to bank notes there as they are an amp machine for this match. 987 trying to acquire target and it lands nothing but net. They're gonna try to score one final note, snatch it out of the grasps of the Blue Alliance. It's right there in the subwoofer. Will they get caught up on some of the defense? TKO snags it from them. 192 GRT scoring another note there into the amp. As the high rollers looking around, getting ready to climb. They're seeing some solid defense on the blue side of the field from the Space Cookies. And TKO is up in the air. Trying to spotlight on the GRT, GRT machine. They have their hooks engaged. That bumper corner is just barely off the ground as time expires. Pulling the upset 53 to 31. Blue Alliance now advances on to match number eight in round two, whereas Red Alliance will head down to the lower bracket. We'll see them again in match number six.